Hi Rasslers, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're fabulous. In this video, I am going to be chit chatting about what does success mean to you? So do get involved and put in the comment box your opinions on this and let's discuss together. Of course, these are just my opinions. Yours might be completely different. It's just a general question and I thought, see what I think on this subject and want to get a discussion going basically. So what does success mean to me? Well, I think success is seen differently in different people's eyes. For me, I think success is being able to inspire other people, being able to, for people to see your work, I'm using it as in art terms and this, see your work and be inspired and think, oh, I can do that, but slightly different, give it a different twist or, of course you want someone to see your work and it's in a gallery and you've got a massive show. I mean that is success that people know your name and know who you are and you're able to sell paintings and make a living. I think that is successful, make a living off what you're doing because at the end of the day in this world unfortunately or fortunately it depends how you think about it we have to of course have money to make a living. Um, It'd be very helpful, well, it would be very cool if we could be in a little area that this doesn't have to be happening and you're in the woodland area that you're able to not do this, but you do have to make money to succeed and be able to live. So that is obviously a part of it. But with the whole thing of what I think success is, is like I just said, is you want people to be inspired by your work, you want people to, you motivate people, you, they see you as a kind of positive person and they can go to you to get inspiration I guess. I would like someone to be able to do that with my work, they can come and see my work and think oh that's really cool, I love the feeling that comes across from the work and the vibe that person gives off and the energy and I think if you do that, if you're an inspiration to someone else then that is inspiring in itself I feel and that is success if you are that someone puts you really highly I mean your work doesn't always have to be fabulous I mean sometimes you make stuff just to do it for the process it doesn't have to be always amazing work that you make because sometimes you make stuff for the process of you de developing as an artist rather than it to be the final piece. Also, success sometimes can happen to people who are literally in the right time at the right moment. It doesn't mean that they are amazing artists, they're just literally in the right time at the right moment, or they are amazing artists and they are in that right time at the right moment. For example, with um, Lots of artists that I know from the past. Uh, let's give an example. With Tracy and Bed, with that, of course, she nearly didn't put anything into a show, but then she decided and saw it and thought, oh, I'm going to put this into the show. People can say it's not her best work, it's not amazing piece of artwork, but she did it and it it was so big and due to this that made her huge and that made her a talking point and then from then on everyone knows that name and everyone thinks of that due to that was the bit what made her kind of go crazy over the art world. So sometimes it is being in the right time at the right moment, it could be one piece of artwork that someone sees and thinks that is amazing and then due from that all the other art pieces are shown as well but they are known from that art piece because artists in general even Picasso made so many different art pieces that people don't really know about or Dali or Vincent van Gogh Frida Kahlo I'm just gonna keep throwing names out there that don't you don't know about due to they're not as big as the other art pieces that they've made because when you think of artists, you always think of certain art pieces, don't you? Um, like Dali, the persistence of memory, 
of the melting clocks and Frida Kahlo with the monobrow and um, who else can we say? Of course with Van Gogh, you always think of a portrait of him and like I said with Tracy Evan. I mean you get what I mean. You always think of a certain art piece of being that successful art piece but they've always made other art pieces to get there and sculptures and shows and performance of all the different arts of course. But my view of success is that if you can inspire and motivate and give inspiration to others then you succeeded. It is fabulous to be able to live off your artwork and make money from it as well in your success bubble because like I say that is how the world goes round but I think my view on success is if you're able to succeed in inspiring and motivating people you succeeded and you're successful. If you like this kind of video do give me a huge thumbs up because then I know you think it's fabulous and remember to get involved and put in the comment box anything you want to discuss in another video and put your view on this topic as well and remember to subscribe to my channel by clicking on the subscribe button to be part of my Raz Desmond Art family on my YouTube community and if you want to follow me on my Instagram that is Raz Desmond Art to be that community as well where I upload all my latest art pieces and you can like and comment and be part of that little bubble as well and I am on Etsy where I show and you can buy any of my art pieces in prints or canvases. So like I always say, stay arty and creative and see you guys later.